This is the condensing unit outside, the main house. It's being outside of the main house. See these seams right here? They're not supposed to be sealed like that. It's supposed to be flashing tape underneath them. It's the main disconnect. Sorry, rough start. This unit is not supposed, to close, not supposed to be closer to the house than 12 inches. The condensing unit is supposed to be higher from the ground than 3 inches. This was okay when it was installed, but this foam is no longer, no longer allowed. It should be rigid. Those Schrader valve caps, those refrigerant caps right there, they, <laughs> my notes, okay. Uh, by today's standards, they would have anti-theft caps on them. Here's your data plate, I believe. Once this is all processed, and we all look at it, we're going to find out it's 13 sear. We're going to find out that it's 5 tons. We're going to find out it's 13 years old. Okay, now here's the difference between 5 tons. The inside is 4 tons, so the inside unit and the outside unit may not be matched. I'm not positive about that, but this seems to be the case today. Uh, it's a refrigerant, R22 refrigerant. That's obsolete. It's no longer manufactured or imported. You can still buy it. You can still sell it. That's true, but it costs a lot. And they sell alternative refrigerants as well, and they also cost a lot. And if this is a SEER 13, so. It's already not up to current standards, and the new refrigerant, they're not as efficient. They're running from, from 10 to 35% less efficient than the others. So it's just not getting the, it's not getting what you want out of it. It's not getting what you want out of it. And um, you use the alternative refrigerant, and most other technicians are not gonna wanna follow you. They're just not, they're not gonna follow that, that technician. Okay, so you might as well marry him. Ha ha ha, dead jokes, but the thing is, is that you, you will be tied to that technician if you run an alternative refrigerant. You'll be running it inefficiently, and the system's 12 years old already. So they last about 14. Engineered on paper to last 20. You may get, your mileage may vary. You may get plenty of good mileage. I had one that lasted 30 something years. I can't remember now, it's been so long ago. But Las Vegas is gonna give you 12. Uh, excuse me, Las Vegas is gonna give you 14. So it's just time. It's time for this guy, based on its refrigerant and its age. Well, it's too cold out here today. It's 50 degrees, so we did not operate this. I know it came online. We bumped it, but um, but we don't know how efficiently it's even operating today. Well, we don't have a clue. We don't have a clue how efficiently it's operating today.